Welcome to another instructional video from OWL, the wise choice in fiber optic test equipment. I'm Professor Jim Powers. OWL Trek 2 series OTDRs are the wise choice in OTDR testing, with size that fits in your pocket, but still has all the bells and whistles that the big OTDRs have, all for a price that fits in your wallet. Most OTR manufacturers tend to implement an all-in-one approach by integrating multi-mode and single-mode OTDR testing into a single quad-wavelength OTDR unit. At first, having multi-mode and single-mode integrated into one OTDR unit seems like a good idea, but actually it can be considered a disadvantage, and here's a couple of reasons why. First, companies who install and test communications networks need to keep multiple crews working simultaneously in order to stay profitable. And second, most fiber optic jobs include either multi-mode or single-mode fibers, but usually not both, and usually not in the same location. Consider this example. An installer company in Illinois purchased an integrated quad multi-mode single-mode OTDR for their installers. They have a crew installing multi-mode fibers in Springfield, and another crew installing single-mode fibers in Peoria at the same time. In this scenario, not only would one of the crews be sitting around waiting for the other crew to finish testing, a considerable amount of valuable time and cost would be wasted in shipping or transporting the unit back and forth. Obviously, it would be better if each of these crews had their own OTDR. Unfortunately, purchasing and maintaining more than one ultra-expensive, fully loaded quad OTDR is not an option for cost-conscious installers. If this installer had purchased an OWL Trek 2 quad kit OTDR, they wouldn't have these problems because at OWL, we approach quad OTDRs in a different yet innovative way by including separate dual wavelength multi-mode and single mode OTDRs in the same kit. Both of these crews could have do their jobs simultaneously without having to purchase and maintain two separate ultra expensive over integrated quad OTDRs. And even with two separate units, the OWL Trek 2 quad kit OTDR is still more cost effective than other manufacturers quad wavelength OTDR options. It's like getting two OTDRs for the price of one. Each OWL Trek 2 quad kit OTDR includes an OWL Trek 2 multi mode 850 1300 OTDR, an OWL Trek 2 single mode 1310 1550 OTDR, an integrated visual fault locator port in each OTDR unit, USB download cables and battery chargers, a USB flash drive containing OWL View Trace software, USB driver, product manuals, and product videos all enclosed in a hard shell carrying case. Altrek 2 OTDRs are capable of finding breaks in single mode and multi mode optical fibers within plus or minus 6 feet, out to a maximum distance of 80 miles in single mode and 12 miles in multi mode. Additional splices and other loss producing events will limit end distance estimates, which is true for all OTDRs. However, when you stop to consider that most passive single-mode telco lengths are almost always less than 12 miles long, and multi-mode lengths are less than one and a quarter miles long, spending thousands of dollars more for a little bit of extra dynamic range that you will probably never use is frivolous and unwise. Live mode is an advanced feature normally found in high-end OTDRs. Live mode continuously shoots OTDR traces, allowing users to monitor changes in the optical fiber in real time. In addition, when the OWL Trek 2 is attached to a PC, all of your software includes a live viewer mode that takes the OTDR trace and expands it onto the PC display for easy viewing. Automatic event location is an advanced feature normally found only in expensive high-end OTDRs. With OWL Trek 2 OTDRs, OWL now brings this feature to the everyday OTDR market. While in the event location mode, the OWL Trek 2 OTDR marks the events on the trace and has an event table showing the location, type, reflectance level, and loss of each event, and auto zooms to the selected event. Owl Trek 2 OTDRs may be pocket-sized, 
but their high-resolution color LCD display can show even the longest traces with ease. And for greater viewing flexibility and trace detail, OWL has implemented state-of-the-art MEMS technology, which flips the high-resolution color LCD display between portrait and landscape mode automatically. In landscape mode, a wider viewing area means greater viewing detail. Each OWLTREK 2 OTDR comes with an integrated visual fault locator port specifically designed for optimal coupling into optical fibers. VFLs are useful for quick troubleshooting of faults behind patch panels that may be too close to the patch panel connection for the OTDR to detect. Other useful functions of VFLs include visual fiber identification and mechanical splice connector termination. All of you software is provided with each OTDR to allow users to download, analyze, and manage stored traces. Important software features include automatic event analysis and event tables, export function for storing OTDR traces in industry standard Telcoria GR196 2.0 file format, a help menu with links to manuals, quick reference guides, and videos, and printed reports for hard copy record keeping. Call OWL for more information about this new and exciting development in OTDR testing and discover why OWL is the wise choice in fiber optic test equipment. This has been another instructional video from OWL, the wise choice in fiber optic test equipment. For more information about additional instructional videos or OWL fiber optic test equipment in general, please visit OWL's website at owl-inc.com. I'm Professor Jim Powers. Thanks for watching.